Stuart, you um, you've got lots of different skills. You've got you know you've got research, you've got architects, you've got you've got engineers. I mean, how do they all work together uh, to I suppose to add value to your clients? Often the buildings that we get involved with um, have a multitude of problems with them, um, and um, Traditionally, in the expert industry, it's the, the different um, disciplines have, have worked with different in different practices, and therefore uh, our clients, our, the solicitors that appoint us, have to go to all these different practices and get dis disparate people mm. to to fulfil the roles. Whereas they can come to us, we can put it all under one banner, have one point of contact, and make sure that we all work homogeneously together to deliver a really high standard product at a much better uh, a much better value. Just the other week I was on a, a, a building looking at the, a, the, the roof, a roof was leaking. So I was inspecting the roof and, 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 and trying to understand where the leaks were coming in and what to do about it. And in accessing one of the roofs I was taken through a lift lobby and the, the finish in that lift lobby was cracked. So it was, oh, what's going on here? Um, so when I came back to the office I showed the photographs to Hooman, we had a quick chat about it decided there was quite possibly some structural movement going on so with his input I was able to uh, inform the client of, of a, another potential issue with their building that needed corrected um, and then subsequently they've appointed Hooman to go out and inspect that and, and where Ruby fits into that role is she will do some background research on the products, um, bring stuff off the internet or, 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 or and, and find contemporaneous literature because we've always got to refer back to the literature that was available in the building regulations when the building was built, not current standards. And then when we produce the reports, Ruby checks them for us to make sure uh, that the technical content in them isn't too technical. It can be understand, but understood by, well, the, the, te the, te the way of putting it is the man in the street, but it's for the solicitors and the judges to be able to understand if the dispute ever gets to that 